Hello and welcome to another unboxing. Uh, this time we're going to unbox my new graphics card, the EVGA GeForce GTX 750 Ti, and this is the Superclock Edition. Now uh, first off, let's start by looking around at the box. Um, so basically, I needed an upgrade from the old GT630, so I bought the 750 Ti. It's got Every single TI has 2 gigabytes of GDDR5 RAM in them. Um, 1 gigabyte isn't as sufficient anymore as it used to sound a couple years ago, maybe like 1 or 2. Um, it comes with GPU Boost 2.0, which is like a NVIDIA built-in um, clock rate adjustment thing. It's kind of like if you're, uh, when your laptop processor underclocks when you're not using it type thing. Um, the 750Ti's are uh, G-Sync ready, and uh, the super clock means that basically it just has a normal default clock that goes higher than what you would have to do if you wanted to overclock it. So it's basically base overclock, and it's designed for that. Um, the card is basically this big. We'll see that when it gets out. Um, it has DisplayPort, HDMI, and DVI ports on it. Um, there's a bunch of small text here, but I'll read it to you. Um, it, it has uh, NVIDIA TXAA, GPU Boost, PhysX, FXAA, ver Adaptive Vertical Sync, which is V-Sync, Surround Sound, um, uh, DirectX 11.2, 3D Vision, uh, it's got CUDA cores in it, excuse me. PCI Express 3.0 support, OpenGL 4.4, OpenCL, NVIDIA Shield, G-Sync. So if you wanted to hook up a shield to this, that can actually happen. Um, I'm not sure how well it works. I don't own a shield, no. And inside this box is telling us we have a 750Ti, obviously. The driver software disk, which may as well just be a Frisbee. Uh, DVI to VGA adapter, which I'll be using because this, this TV I have. Um, does not like HDMI. It actually gets really ugly looking. Uh, user guide and accessory pack. Probably a sticker of some kind. Uh, it's got different languages across the box, so let's open the box. Now uh, this is different from the Zotac box, I can see. Okay. Electrostatic area, or sensitive area. <laughs> Keep my graphics card in the most electrostatic area possible. My bubble wrap is falling on the ground. So here's the card. Like I said, it's not very big. Um, if you're familiar with this cooler, it's the same one that EVGA uses on their uh, 650s and 650Ti's and maybe as far back as the 750Ti's but I don't remember because back then I wasn't really into um, the computing market. Um, if someone would like to confirm that for me or not, I might just check it after I get done here too. Oh, we got protective film over it. That's nice. So here's the card itself out of the box. It's got a protector on the PCI slot. Fan feels nice. No bearing rub, nothing bad. Connect uh, protectors over all the other slots. Yes. I was prepared for this. So yeah, so let's talk about the 750 Ti a little bit more. The Ti is the newest architecture of graphics card from NVIDIA. It's the Maxwell architecture. Um, I intend to make all kinds of coffee puns. Um, but yeah, I basically decided to make my house a Maxwell house and this is the way to do it. And the one of the best parts about these graphic cards is that uh, they only have a 60 watt like max draw, even overclocked. And Nvidia, for the first time in a long time, has said overclock the crap out of these. And it's a major upgrade to my GT630. 
So what else do we have in the box? We have a user guide, um, basically how to install it in every single language on demand. I believe this is the poster I heard about. With a very creepy dude going on on it. Holy crap. I don't want to hang that on my wall. I have to eat, he'll eat my soul. Look at that. Hey there. Art, art of the game. I don't even know. People are making noises. So yeah, big freaking poster to go with stuff. Ooh, is this a badge? Uh, it, it's stuck to the frisbee though. It is, look at that. That's not a sticker, that's an actual badge powered by EVDA, look at that. I like that. <laughs> I don't know why it was st stuck, but it was stuck inside of the CD. Um, and then the last thing in the box is this guy, which you probably, there you go. It's just a VGA to a, or a DVI to a VGA connector. So let's take the badge out. Look at that quick. And then that'll be the end of this video. So yeah, powered by EVGA. I like how it's got a flaming wrench on it, it's kind of cool. It's like a car thing going for it. Okay, so... That's it for this, guys. Uh, I hope you like looking at it. And uh, like, subscribe, whatever. I'll pr be pretty sure I'm going to be unboxing more computer stuff as I get it. And um, if you watched my um, building of my crate box, which uh, is also on my channel, which was the PC I have now, I bought a motherboard with only two expansion slots. So this is a PCI 1X uh, expansion slot. My wireless card's gonna plug in this, it's gonna go, and it's gonna go underneath this card, in and around and up, and then it's gonna allow me to put that slot in another one. This is allowing me to have a dual slot card and use the other expansion slot, because I really do like that wireless card. Um, the reason why I bought one of these is because I heard about them, because I looked into Bitcoin mining like everyone else, and this is probably one of the best inventions to have come out of it, that the price on these lowered from probably being like 100 bucks per ribbon cable to like five cents so yeah that's it guys and i hope you had a good unboxing watching experience yeah